Hi everybody, welcome to HIT on Monday. Today is April 6th. I'm glad to have you here. Um, we are going to be moving for a little while today, doing cardio and keeping it up with um, some strength exercises in between. What you will need today is just a mat. If you want to grab a chair or you can use a couch, we're going to be doing some dips today for upper body. And the other thing, you just need one item, like a water bottle, soup can, anything that you can just hold in your hand. It doesn't have to be a heavy weight, it just has to be something that you can pass from one hand to the other for a couple exercises. Okay? That's all you need. Let's get started. All right, let's get warmed up. Let's do some nice reaches to the front and to the side. Good, let's start at the top. We're gonna to take it from the side all the way down, around and back up to the top, other direction. Make sure you like or comment if you're here with us today. We want to know. If you're on an insurance-based membership, you could be helping the Y. We're not sure if we would get reimbursed or not for your visits online, taking the classes, but if you could like or comment so we know you're there, it only helps us. We want to be there when all this is over. We're ready to open back up quick. Good. Take those shoulders to the back. Good, we're gonna swim it to the front, one arm at a time. Good, take the trunk to the side to side. Good, shake those shoulders out, let's get our lower body warmed up. We can take it side to side, lift those toes up. For HIT today, we are, do, we are doing five exercises in each set. We're doing two rounds of each set. Each set will have upper body, lower body, and core, as well as cardio involved. We're going to take it side to side. So if you are a beginner, we're getting back into this, only do one set. You can walk or jog during the second set just to keep your heart rate up. And if you feel like at the end you haven't gotten a full workout, if you're advanced, then replay it and do at least one more set through. Good. We're just going to drop it down and back up. Bring those legs to almost straight or fully straight if you can. Good, let's do one more. And roll it up. Good, we're gonna bring those knees up and out. Grab a drink anytime you need it today. That's a given. Listen to your body. If something's too hard, do the modification. If the modification is too hard, just walk in place. Out to in. Good, let's bring that knee up, push it back. Good, other side, same thing. Grab a drink if you need it. Before we get started, I'm going to demonstrate all of our exercises for our first set. Before we do that, let's finish with up on the balls of your feet, bring it down to that squat. Reach high. Two more. And last one. Good. Shake it out, grab that drink. All right, so our cardio move this time that we do twice throughout this set are going to be our butt kicks. So you can do this at whatever degree you like. It can just be a march. 
picking the back. It can be a jog. But try to get those feet up as high as you can, as if you're going to be touching your hands. Okay, after that, we're moving into a dip. So that's where you need your couch, your chair, anything that will stay where it's at so that you're uh, supported. And the farther you take your feet out, the harder it is. If you bring your feet closer, it's a little bit easier. Not easy though. Take these at your own pace. If this is all you can do, try to just hold your weight out in front of the seat. If you can, add a dip. You could go the whole way down, or you can just do slight dips. Okay, your choice. Pace is totally up to you. Don't do too much too fast. Spread them out. Okay. We're going to come back to standing after that, and we're going to go into a side lunge. So we're going to take it up to the side, making sure that knee never goes in front of your toe. You're sitting back. Bring it back. We're going to stick with one side, and then lift that leg up. So it's out to the side. Push it back. Leg up. Okay, we're doing one set, or one 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other side. Then we're back to our butt kicks. Then we're taking it down for Russian twist. For this one, you're gonna need that item. You don't have to. If you don't have an item, you don't need it, but it just helps a little bit. So you're gonna hold that item, and we're just gonna go side to side. You're on the heels of your feet. You're leaning back into about a 43 degree angle, and it's side to side, hip to hip. Touching that mat on each side if you can. Okay? All right. Let's get started. I'm gonna get my timer here. Get that drink if you haven't already. All right, we're gonna start with those butt kicks. 30 seconds, then we're moving into our dips. Feet as high as you can. Remember, this could be a walk. Your choice. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. We're gonna take it to the uh, chair or the couch. We're gonna dip it. Or just hold it here, your choice. Pace yourself. Don't do too much or you'll tire yourself up. If you do get tired, just stop or hold it here. 10 more seconds if you can. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, back up to standing. These are those side lunges out to the side. Back up, kick it up. Same leg. Halfway there. Ten more seconds, then we'll switch sides. Three, two, and one. Good. Other side. Here we go. Halfway done. We're headed back into our butt kicks next. Three, two, one. All right, back to our butt kicks. Walk or jog. Knees stay uh, where they are. Feet kick back. We have our Russian twist steps down on the mat. And we're doing round two. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Grab that item if you want. Let's take it down. Heels are on the mat. Take it back 45 degrees. Here we go, side to side. You can only go here, that's okay. And if you need to be down on your elbows, you can go on your elbows, switching side to side. But if you can, try to keep it without the elbows, everything off the mat. Good, 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Grab a quick drink, we're moving right into the second set. Get ready for those butt kicks. Ready? Here we go. Round two, same exercise. 
sizes. Good, 10 more seconds, then we're headed to the dips on the chair or the sofa. Five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. At your own pace or just hold it. Halfway there. Ten seconds. You max out. Stop or hold it here. Three, two, one. Good job. All right, we have those side lunges. Here we go. Kick it up as high as you can. If your kick is only here, that's okay. If you need to hold on to something, feel free. Ten more seconds, then we'll switch sides. Woo! Balance comes and goes. Three, two, and one. Switch sides. Here we go. Oh, our timer. Keep going. Try to catch back in where you were. My timer time is out every once in a while. I need to see a black screen. Good. Halfway there. Keep it up. We're doing butt kicks after this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and move into those butt kicks. You want those feet coming up as high as you can. If you need to put your hands there, make sure you wash your hands up after this. Good, five more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Grab that item. Russian twist. On the heels of your feet, lean it back 45 degrees, and twist. If you need that modification, you can be back on your elbows, reaching to the outside of each knee. But try to stay up without the assist of those elbows. Good, 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Set one is complete. Grab a drink. Alright, while you get that drink, let me run through this next set of exercises. So we have, for our cardio move that we do twice throughout this set, we are taking it into a wide squat. Uh, feet are turned out about 45 degrees. We're going to take it down into that wide squat as low as you can. Make sure that those knees never go over your toes. If they do, take those feet out wider. And then we're going to take it up into a cross punch. So down, crunch, down, punch. You can turn that back foot to face where you're punching and then take it back to neutral for your squat. Okay, so we're doing the wide squat with a cross punch. Then we're getting down on the mat into an elbow plank. You can be on your knees or on your feet and we're doing our up down. So starting in the elbow plank, taking it up to a hand plank and back down at your own pace. Okay, again, on your knees or your hands, if that's too hard, just hold it in one of the plank positions. Then we are going into, uh, you'll need your item. Make sure you choose the water bottle if you have a water bottle that has the lid on it. All right, and we're gonna take it down into that lunge, pass it through, knee never goes in front of your toe. Bring it back, pass it under the other leg. It's like a basketball drill. We're gonna pass it through, all right. Then we're gonna take it back to the wide squats to the cross punch. 
And then we're going to take it down to the mat. Feet are straight up. We're going to reach. Shoulder blades touch the back. Then we're reaching for the toes. Straight up. Chin looks right up to the ceiling. Okay? Doing a high crunch. All right. Let's get ready. We're starting with the uh, wide squat with the cross punch. Are you ready? I am. Let's go. Take it down. Cross it. For those of you from the Y, get your inner Amanda and Julie. Jen, wherever you take. A little Ray, I think. Good. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Take it down to the mat for those up downs. Knees or feet. Take it up. Bring it down. Try to keep that body nice and straight. Ten more seconds. Five, four. Three, two, and one. Take it back up. All right. We have the alternate lunge. Grab that item. We're going to pass it through. Here we go. Take it front. Other side. Good, 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Get ready for those wide squats. So cross punch, here we go. We have our crunch to reach our toes. After this, halfway there. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Take it down. Feet up. Here we go. We're going to crunch up straight to that ceiling. Try not to keep your head, hands behind your head. It makes you pull in the neck. Chin up to the ceiling. Feel in those upper abs. Good. Give me five. Four. Three. Two. One, good job. All right, grab a quick drink. Get ready for round two. All right, we're starting with those wide squats to cross punches. Get ready in five, four, three, two, one. After this, we have our up downs, going from elbow plank to hand plank. Halfway there. Good. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Take it down. Use the other hand to push up this time, if you remember. Starting that plank. Here we go. 30 seconds or max, whichever comes first. Hold it in a plank or rest if you max out. Ten more seconds. Three, two, and one. Good job. All right. 
Grab that water bottle or whatever you have. We're going to lunge and pass it through. Here we go. Straight body. 
Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Back up. We're going to hold it for that squat. Get ready. Feet about shoulder width apart, maybe a little wider. And let's take it down. Hold it here. Make sure those knees are not in front of your toes. All that weight is on your heels. Good job. This is tough. If you get uh, maxed out, you stand up, walk it out. We have 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Shake it up. All right, we're going back into that high knee march. Here we go. We're finishing up with dead bug for this set. Then we have set number two. Ten more seconds. Three, two, and one. Good. Down for dead bug. I'm trying to see the best angle for this for you. Okay. So we are going to have a hand on inner knee. Take it out. We're going to switch. Keeping that chin up. Shoulder blades are off the floor. Knees and hands do not touch. It applies too much pressure on your back. Good. Ten more seconds if you can. Three, two, and one. Good. Grab a quick drink. One more set and we are done today. All right, are we ready? We're gonna start with those marches. If you wanna do high knees and jog in place, feel free. Here we go. Last set, then we'll stretch. Again, if you felt like this didn't challenge you enough, if you still have more to go, once we're done, go ahead and do three more. One more of each. Good, 10 more seconds. Then we have the plank with the arm reaches. Five, four, three, two, and one. Take it down. And here we go, arm reaches. Good job. Halfway there. We have a squat hold next. Five, four, three, two, and one. Take it up. Get in that squat position. Are you ready? Here we go. Take it down. Hold it here. Good job, we're almost there. You can do it halfway. If you max out, rest, stand up. If you can, give me 10 more seconds. Here we go, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, shake it out. Going back to those tiny marches. In three, two, one, here we go. You have dead belly last. And we'll stretch. Halfway, 15 seconds. Ten. Five, four, three, two, and 
One, good. Dead bug. Take it down. Opposite. Hand to the inside of your thigh or knee. I'm gonna take other hand up in that crunch position. Here we go, switch it. Try to straighten that leg. You don't have to if you can't, but take it out as long as you can. Don't touch that foot or hand to the floor. Good, halfway. We will stretch in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, let's go into that swimmer stretch. Hands up above you. Squeeze your ears. Arch that back off the mat. Point your toes. Reach as high as you can. Feel that full body stretch. Good. We're going to take one knee up, or both knees up to our chest. Try not to pull in on your knees, never on the joints. Feel that stretch in the front of your hips. You want to roll side to side on that lower back. And take one leg straight, cross that knee over, keep those shoulder blades on the mat at all times, look straight up, let that knee fall naturally, feel that stretch in your outer hip, in your back, good, let's switch, other leg, take it across, keep those shoulder blades on the mat, look straight up. one arm across the front of your body. Pull it in, not at a joint, at that forearm. Feel it stretching your shoulder. Good, let's switch, other side. Good, take one arm back, tricep stretch. Let's switch other arm. Good, let's take it down, uh, wide feet. Take it down to the center. I did use all copyright free music today. Uh, the YMCA, as a, uh, well, the Valley Points Family YMCA, we do pay licensing fees every year. 
to use music throughout our facilities and for all of our programs and events um, so that we can do that legally. But there are some questions as to what all is allowed to be used online when you're streaming, even though we pay for those rights. Um, it might not be to the whole world. So um, I'm just using copyright free music one, so that I don't have to worry about that. And we can keep these classes coming to you live. All right, switch. And take it back to the center. Reach up. Open that chest. And switch sides. Good, let's roll it up. We're gonna reach up. Stretch that core. And reach to one side. Good, other side. Good. Shake out those shoulders. Last one. Let's take a, one foot back for a quad stretch. Hold on to something if you'd like. And switch. Thank you everybody for joining me. I hope you have a wonderful day. Enjoy it, it's going to be beautiful. See you tomorrow for yoga, Wednesday for